here comes Finn Balor. A man who has truly embraced his darkness and has seen success as a result. The following is a Hell in a Cell match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Judgment Day. From Bray, Kelly Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn. Man has an impressive resume. Plenty of championship reigns. Yet Finn Balor continues to evolve. Pay attention to his newfound cunning and ruthlessness. Yeah, this is not the Finn Balor we once knew. But sometimes change is a good thing. the opportunity that lies ahead. He can make his name tonight at the expense of a Hall of Famer, the rated R superstar, Edge. The two-time Royal Rumble winner. The personification of grit. A superstar looking to reach the pinnacle of his second mountain. There is only one rated R superstar. And his opponent from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 249 pounds, the rated R superstar, Edge. You know, Edge has won and cashed in the very first Money in the Bank contract, and he's found so many unique ways to win. He is truly the ultimate opportunist. We all know this five-ton structure made of 2,700 feet of chain link does not judge, but it punishes. It rewards evil and shows no mercy. It will not relent. Only the men and women who have stepped inside this demonic structure know just how unrelenting it is. And there isn't a soul alive who doesn't have trepidation when they step inside this cell. Huh, I'm just near the cell and I'm feeling uneasy. Ouch. Oh, man. And he was able to turn that around on Balor. Boom, what an uppercut. Caught square by the Haymaker. Oh! Re-entering the ring now. Inelegant exit, but if it works, it works. As we all know, Hell in a Cell matches tend to deteriorate once the competitors leave the confines of the ring. Ooh, oh, what an uppercut! Sorry. Oh. Boom, what impact! Ow! Oh. Punching their way out of that one. Counter after counter. Sequence of reversals there. These two showing how well scouted they each are. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. Going counter for counter. Now can it be capitalized on? Oh! 
What a punch. Oh, he's looking a little off balance. Oof, had it scouted and met with a back elbow. He climbs into the ring. Hell in a Cell is such a demonic structure that exists solely for pain and suffering. This could be it. Cover. No, he pops the shoulder before three. Wow. This is what you call high risk, high reward. Oh, oh my God. And it's Edge getting out of that one. Held in a perilous position. Ah, oh, the power. A gorilla press right into the side of the cell. He steps foot in the ring again. And just like that, he said, crashing to the floor. Edge not paying much mind to what he's hearing from the WWE Universe. Uh-oh. Oh, I had that well scouted. He manages to escape it. Dangerous area inside the cell. And of course, kendo sticks are always under the ring in the event of any rogue ninja attacks. Out of the ring and into hell itself. Oh, that'll rattle you. Oh! What's Balor banking on here? He broke right through the wall! My God! Who knows where these superstars will end up now? I don't think even they know. Stay away from us. Ooh, forearm connects. And Edge is coming under duress. Finn is reaching that other level. Caught with a punch. And Balor's attack gets cut off. Ah, oh, what an uppercut. So impactful. This is where superstars become legends, Cole. Well, I'm not so sure he knows what he's doing, guys. Who are you to question him? Oof. They're duking it out of the side of the cell. Absolutely not the place you want to be right now. In, out, around, on top of the cell. It's all hell, Cole. Ooh. They say the only way out of hell is up, but I don't think they're heading towards salvation. Balor retaliates. Dear life now, a fall from the side of the cell would be devastating. I could hear the entire WWE Universe gasping in unison. Paying it back with their own count. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. Oh, ouch! Interrupting their climb on the cell, forced to do battle on the side of this demonic structure. One mistake could be your undoing here. He's reached the top. Now what? I oh, so the thing. Do it. Here he goes, right up the side of the cell. Making it look easy. Oh, this has to be zapping every last bit of energy. Finn is not showing a single shred of doubt. Spear! Ballard's in deep peril here. Here it comes! The Impaler! Enough is enough for bludgeoning their opponent. We've already 
seen. Part of the cell break apart. No telling what more can break apart. Is now these athletes are taking their chances in a very perilous position at the top of Hell in a Cell. Sit down, power bomb. Where do these superstars get the idea to do this? I don't know, but if this is something they dreamt up, I wouldn't want to know what their nightmares look like. Big elbow. Uh-oh. We're gonna see it. What power. Oh, did you hear that thud? Boom! My gosh, this is making the hair on my neck stand up. The nervous energy has come across this arena. Aller with driven down 1916. Aller could take this one. Back and forth, blow for blow. Neither Edge nor Finn giving up any ground. Everyone in this building is just waiting on bated breath. We've all seen life-altering moments come from the top of that cell. Spear by Edge. Here's Edge's big chance. Real barrel. Flapjack. Face first. How can they even compete up there? How are they not frozen with fear? When you hold this much contempt for your opponent, you'll do anything you have to to drag him to hell. Side slam. Closer to the chain link enclosure. He's climbing the cell now, guys. On the move. I must say, he's got impressive climbing skills. You're the best, Byron. The WWE Universe matching Balor's energy here as this match continues. Someone get the EMTs ready. I just know this isn't going to end well. Precariously battling 25 feet up in the air. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. What a fool. He had him dead to rights. Oh, this is beyond dangerous. This is more than reckless. No one should be up there, let alone performing these maneuvers. With authority. Oh, I can't watch this, guys. I can't look. the table, Saxon, there's a human being under the wreckage. Kick right to the back of the leg. Uppercut connects. Back elbow blows that one. What a headbutt. Vicious. Oh, man, what an uppercut. And now he's making the ascent up the cell. Why? Remember, though, what goes up must come down, and sometimes it's the coming down part that gets you. He has scaled to the top of the cell. There's no easy way down now. We might have company atop the cell. Let's make it a party. If it's me, I, I just wait here on the ground, you know, where it's much safer. Good, go home, Saxton. Yeah, because you have no courage. He made it to the top. Oh, just stop moving. And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. And Balor for control here. 1916. Terrible position for Edge. Just like that, edge of age. Single leg drop kick caught him. Hooked up. Boom! There are heights, and then there are heights. Being at the top of hell in a cell, tensions high and tempers even higher as we're seeing. No chance of cooler heads prevailing here. He reverses it. with a sling blade. 
and a basement drop kick. They got up there, but how are they going to get down? I don't know if they thought that far ahead. That didn't look good for Balor. And we can see just how bad it was all over his face. Edge on the receiving end. There's not a single person sitting in this arena. It's pandemonium, Cole. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Now to see what you're made of. Oh, gut check. And with every step up there, the amount of fear on these superstars increases. The top of the cell is like walking through a minefield. Into the snap suplex. Edge taking a beat to think through his next steps. Up, but we didn't think the hell was going to be let loose above the cell. Edge looking to cinch it in. Can he turn him over? Indeed he does. Educator, apply. Well, this isn't going to win the fall, but it's going to do a lot of damage. his former master. Edge just didn't have what it takes tonight to stop Finn. But Edge certainly made him earn this. You wonder if this really does anything to diminish Edge's determination. This rivalry may just rear his head again in the future. 